Okay, today we're gonna go over the Gurnoku texture pack. It's a nice texture pack, but I'm sure the lag on this one will be like one FPS. So I'm gonna want to kill myself, but I'm gonna try to get through the video because you know that's this is gonna be the only Minecraft videos I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do other ones if I when I get a new laptop or when I can use other people's laptops, which is kind of common. So yeah, like maybe weekly videos, maybe even monthly. But I'll, I'll probably. Like, like, say, if I stay the night at my friend's house who plays Minecraft, I'll probably make, like, me and him. He has a really nice laptop uh, that he can use at his mom's. And then he has a big desktop that's really nice. We would probably both play those and make a couple commentaries, like six or seven commentaries, and then post them throughout the time that I'm not at his house. So this is a Gurnoku texture pack. Um, it's not patched, so some of the shit looks weird. But honestly, it always looks like that. This is the cake. Fences. Um, bedrock. Stone. Grass. Cobblestone. Planks. Wood. Other wood. Other wood. Gold. Iron. Uh, uh, coal. Redstone. Diamond. Mossy stone. The things look just the same. So that looks really neat right there. All the paintings like that one. There's like a little map there. That's really neat. Really neat. I'm sure the trains go fucking over. Ah, I hate this part of the goddamn map. And that's the only thing I have noticed with this text pack. Now, you guys are wondering, well, you know, it's Cameron. It's not doing that because you didn't patch it. No. No, 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 no. That's not the deal, motherfuckers. Yeah, I didn't patch it. But that's how it always looks. Like, redstone when you put it down. Because I did patch it before, and then when you patch it, you get the moving animation for the lava and the water. That's the only really difference. Yeah, and torches. I really, I love the torches on this one. That is, no, when I say that's the only reason I downloaded it, it's the only reason. And it was definitely well lived. This is Louis Slepazil. Honestly, I like like this. It's really neat. That's soul sand, glowstone. Pumpkins, clay, jack o' lanterns, whatever, um, note blocks, iron. Yeah, so yet again, shitty test pack all around. It's terrible. Don't get it. I like the honeydew skin I can actually use with this text pack because I have the crack version of Minecraft. Next video will be how to get a skin without buying Minecraft. But it's, it's nice at first if you have a really nice computer, but I think that you'd have to go in and change, like, some of the blocks, because some of the blocks, like, just do it in for me. Like, the grass, super common block. I just can't stand having it all crazy. Not at all. So, yet again, I'm going to end the video with showing you the in-game textures. They're really nice. I would love to use these all the time. One thing I do love about this texture pack is, no, no not that. Don't love that at all. Is the way the pickaxes look, and then the way how the shovel's, like, sideways. Yeah, so that is it for today, yet again. Sorry I've been posting short videos, but I really don't like these texture packs, so haven't been too excited about just, oh yeah, look at this part, uh, look at this part, look at this part, look at those parts, so fucking cool. Yeah. So, um, that's it. That's it. That's it tonight. That's it. That's the only time. White Boy 17 is not really White Boy 17. It's coming. It's White Man 17. Yeah.